Hello everyone, welcome to Tiwi World channel. If it's your first time here, you are welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for always supporting. In this video, you will know signs to identify a witch and a wizard around you. Please take this video seriously. Witches are destroyers and you cannot devour them around you. If you keep them around you, they will steal, kill and destroy you. You can identify them around you with these signs mentioned in the video. I encourage you to watch this video and watch it to the end. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. God bless you. How can you help, uncle? I need that money by Saturday. I don't want that business to slip out of my hand. It's a lot of money. I know. But you have to help me, uncle. When I get back to the office, I will work out something. Even if it's half of the money, I will be grateful. What are you talking about? I will give you all the money? How do you plan on balancing the remaining half if I don't give you the full money? You are the best uncle in the whole world. Yes! Yes, best uncle in the world. Today is Wednesday, you can come to my office on Friday. I will be traveling tomorrow but I will return back to town Friday morning. You can come to the office around 10 in the morning. Come for the money on Friday, 10 in the morning. This is unbelievable. Giving me all the money is mind-blowing. Thank you so much, I am grateful. You are welcome, Laura. Good morning, sis. I have been waiting all day. I had to rush out to see my uncle. I apologize for keeping you waiting. It's all right, sis. How is your mom doing? Very well. Your mom told me you will be staying with me for a couple of days. She had an emergency call from her mother. I hope her mom is all right. From what I heard, she's very sick. So sorry about that. Thank you, sis. You are welcome, my dear. You are welcome to my home. Your mom has been a good neighbor. I think I have seen you once or twice. I am not too sure. She just called me last night that her daughter will be coming over. It's fine, anyway. Let me cook so we can eat. All right, thank you sis. This place is so beautiful. I didn't realize her home is this beautiful. A nice view she has got. I am famished. I need food. Food is ready. Come with me. Wow. Thank you so much, sis. Good morning, Kate. Good morning, sis. How was your night? Very fine. Thank you for the warm hospitality. You are welcome. I am going out now. I will be back in the afternoon. I have an important appointment by 10. I don't want to go late. You breakfast is on the table. You can microwave it if it gets cold. If you need anything, do not hesitate to call me. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Bye. Good morning. Is my uncle back? He gave me an appointment for 10. I have been trying to call him but his number is switched off. Something terrible happened this morning. We just got the news not quite long. What are you talking about? What happened? The chairman was involved in an accident on his way back from his trip this morning. He has been rushed to the hospital. No. No. This is not happening. What am I going to do now? Anywhere I get to, it is my duty to commit a harvick there. I will surely commit a harvick here in the few days I will be spending here. <laughs> Nothing good will happen in this house as long as I am here. I have spoken. Welcome back, sis. Thank you. Are you alright? 
You don't look happy. I went to see my uncle at his office and I was told he was involved in an accident this morning. Don't cry sis, I am sure he will be fine. I am so sorry about your uncle's incident. Thank you, Kate. I hope you are alright. Have you eaten lunch? Yes, I am alright. I have eaten. Let us go inside. He will be fine. I am so sorry about your uncle's incident. Thank you. What do you want to do about the money? I don't know. Honestly. I have to pay that money or I will lose that business deal. I have been thinking. I will lend you but you will pay me back. I am withdrawing all money for you. Are you serious now? Yes. Thank you so much, my friend. I will send you the money tomorrow. Wow. Thank you so much. Please, stop crying. How did it happen? I don't know. I have been scammed. All my money is gone. Everything. Oh my goodness. I am sorry, Ella. I don't know what the scammers used on me. Everything is gone. I won't be able to loan you the money. I am sorry. I understand you. I am not angry. What is going on? Why all these bad things? My uncle is still in the hospital. Ella got scammed. What is happening to me? I am in charge here. Nothing good will enter this house. <laughs> One of the signs to identify that all witches around you is that bad things will suddenly start to happen to you. Evil that you didn't expect to happen will suddenly happen to you. If things like this occur, then check it. Someone around you is a witch or wizard manipulating and bringing evil your way. Getting help becomes difficult. Good things no longer comes your way. You have to enter into prayers immediately to destroy the works of darkness. Please, do not ignore. Hi, Lizzie. Welcome back. Thank you. I saw that a guy dropped you off now. Yes. Fred. That was Fred. I think Fred loves me and I am beginning to love him too. Be careful of that guy. Be careful of what if I may ask. What I am feeling about that guy is not too good. He looks like a flirt. How does a flirt look like if I may ask you, my dear cousin? I am just trying to look out for you. The last guy I brought home, you said the same thing that he looks like a flirt and I stopped seeing him. You barely know Fred and you are already seeing him as a flirt. That was what I felt. And I know that my feelings are always right. Fred is such a nice guy, I am not sure he is capable of cheating. You know how fragile you are when it comes to love things. I don't want to see you heartbroken, that is why I am this concerned. Thank you so much. I know that you will never mislead me. You always want the best for me. I always do. Trust me, you will find a genuine person. That I know. You don't have to feel bad about it, you are doing the right thing and what is best for you. You cannot be in a relationship if I am not in a relationship. You cannot get married when I am still single and has no one asking for me hand in marriage. I am more beautiful. How is getting getting all this guys? You can never be in a relationship not to talk of getting married. The second way to identify that someone close to you is a witch is that he or she will also oppose any good thing you have. They will never see anything good in you in whatever you have. It might be your talent, gift what you have and so on. It's a sign for you to know that that person is a witch or wizard and is trying to manipulate and bring you down. Be careful of such people. They never see any good in you. They don't want you to get what they don't have.
The third sign on how to identify a witch around you is that, you always lost your peace when they are around you. You are not comfortable to speak, or share things with them. You cannot leave such person alone in your house when they visit. You just feel that you can't trust them with anything. You see them as strangers even though that person is close to you. Your spirit is discerning something that is why you are not always at peace when the person is around you. This is a powerful sign that this person is a witch or a wizard. Be careful around such person. They are snakes. If you want me to share more of these signs, let me know in the comment section. Thank you for watching. Please, subscribe for more inspiring content. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. God bless you.